Sports Minister Olivia Grange says her ministry will be looking at providing continued assistance to sports persons who are hardest hit by the effects of COVID-19. Here's Jermaine Brown. In February, Minister Grange announced an athlete's assistance program of $80,000 per athlete per month for those preparing for the Olympic Games. But the postponement of the Games has now seen that initiative come to a halt. With the cancellation of a number of events affecting athletes financially, Minister Grange says the government will now look at ways of providing further financial support. Well, you know, the care package is very broad and it covers Jamaicans across all sectors. So what we have done, we have gone through the care package. We have had discussions with the Minister of Finance and the Minister of Finance um, technocrats. And we have identified areas in which our, the athletes can benefit. We're going to be having a meeting, a town hall meeting, a digital town hall meeting with the various sporting organizations as well as the individual organizations and membership of those organizations to discuss, to break out the package as to who can get compassionate grants and who can get other cash grants that are made available. In addition, we are repurposing our budget here at the ministry as well as in the Sports Development Foundation to see how we can give small grants to some of the athletes who are going to lose income because they're not able now to go out and compete. And Minister Grange says footballers in the Red Star Premier League are high on her list of those who will receive assistance. For example, the Premier League players, I know it's, it's really, really, really tough for them because in the season, they're accustomed to getting a salary. And a lot of those players are from poor communities and they're normally unemployed. And so they're at the top of my list to give some consideration to happen by the EFF. Yeah. And I'm giving some consideration to, to the requests that they have made. I've been written to by the chairman of the PLCA and I'm in discussion with him how we can assist. Minister Grange added that of the 135 athletes from seven disciplines who were earmarked to receive the funds, only track and field athletes were yet to be paid for the month of March. She was speaking on Ardra Glina Group's virtual sports town hall meeting on Thursday.